So, uh, Mr. Menzies, why was it not made clear when the budget bill implementation bill was introduced? Why was well, it not made clear that, in fact, the EI provisions could be paid out of the current fiscal year and not the next fiscal year, like everything else in the bill? And why was it only made clear on Tuesday, specifically clear on Tuesday at a Senate committee and not in the House when the bill was taken up? Well, let's, uh, let's make sure that people understand that what Mr. Goodale just said is not factually correct. Uh, the Liberals made a mistake, and a serious mistake, that's impacted a lot of Canadians. On the 6th of February, the bill was tabled in the House. The Budget Implementation Act was tabled in the House. On the 9th of February, I provided, along with a number of officials, a five-hour briefing where we invited all MPs and senators. And in that briefing that was only attended by some of the Liberals, a few senators, and some Conservatives, no bloc, no NDP there even to get the answers to their questions. It was, re it was uh, stated in that briefing that EI extension took effect upon royal assent. And in fact, in the House of Commons, in answer to a question on the 12th of February, the finance minister said exactly that. So there's no surprise. The finance minister said, in fact, when I was answering a question during a speech in the House of Commons that I gave on the 27th of February, I repeated that, that the EI benefits would take effect, the extension would take effect upon royal assent. And then again, I repeated it on the 3rd of March. So no surprise, Don. They just weren't following the facts, and, and it is, he well, talks well, about what, jobs. Well, you said, okay, but I'm looking at, at the Hansard from February 27th, where you're speaking, and you said, the EI is tied up until we pass this bill. You didn't say it would take, that's not the same thing I put to you, Ted Menzies, as saying it would take effect on royal assent, because everything in the bill is tied up until it's passed, and it wasn't passed till May 24th, none of the money would be spent, even though you're in the new fiscal year. So, saying upon royal assent, is different from saying until we pass the bill. Well, perhaps I wasn't clear enough in my answer, but, but to me, passing a bill through Parliament is royal assent. That's the final stage. I think most Canadians know that's the final stage. Royal assent, and that when we pass the bill, I mean, that, that is royal assent. That is when EI took effect, and it, it took... Uh, I actually I sincerely think the Senators were surprised on Tuesday. So my... Uh, my well, they were. No, they were. Yeah, absolutely, well, well, they were. Well, and Mr. Mr. Not... Flaherty came out on Tuesday. He surprised me. I admit, I didn't know. And well, I said, but, no, I, Mr. Flaherty, you're wrong. It isn't, it's, it's not until the 1st of April. And he said, not employment insurance. No. But one of the reasons I said it, not till the 1st of April, because someone asked him in the House earlier, uh, from the opposition side, probably the Liberals, look, what's the big fuss about the Senate? Because you can't spend any of the money until April 1st. And at that time, he didn't reply and say, no, uh, we could spend the EI, but not anything else. So I think that's why I was confused anyway, and I only can speak for myself. Well, and, and, and that's fair enough. Uh, we don't expect you to follow every debate in the House of Commons, Don, but we do expect the leader of the official opposition to follow the debates. The, the finance minister was very clear on the 12th of February. He said that, it, in answer to a question, mm -hmm. EI extended benefits do not come into effect until this bill passes the House, and whichever term you want to use, I'm not going to split hairs here, passing Budget Implementation Act or Royal Assent. Royal Assent is the well, end of passing well, the Act. Royal Assent is after it's passed the Senate and then got Royal Assent. Anyway, Ted, I'm sure we'll have another chance to talk soon. Our time goes so quickly now. But I thanks look for forward coming to on. it. Thanks, Don.